All right, you want me to go this way? Fine. How many do I have? Uh, six. That's not too shabby. But we're going to Niflheim again. There's one. Hmm. There's a few. Oh shit. I didn't mean to do that. Oh god. And it's back. Great. Can I reload that? Yeah. I don't want to mess up on that. Simply because I don't want to spend all my stuff pointlessly. Cool. I got that audio log as well, right? Number 14, regrets. Yeah, okay. Oh man, I don't know where to go. That's good. These things are just all over the place. And they walk so creepy. I think this is probably the best option is to like go through rooms. Go through each and every room. Oh shit, there's one right there. Okay, this is that room. Was there really nothing in here? Alright, well, at least it's like an area that I can, like, be in if I need to, like, run to here. So it's pretty much better than nothing. Okay. Nothing pop around the corner. Y'all are just gonna let me go, right? Thank you. Okay. Is this where I'm supposed to go? Probably. I want to see what's over here. Well, there's something. Ah! Uh -huh. Exploring Netsu items. Who to thunk? Alright. 
Oh god. Get lost, dude. That was horrible. Just casually, like, approached me. Carry this you casual. What an ass. Aha. Uh -huh. There's two. Running out of that. Come on, really? Are you really, dude? Oh, I saw you. I know they come back. I can get do this quickly. God. Shit. That was absolutely horrible. Do they climb ladders? Because if they do, screw you, maker of this game. Don't make these characters climb ladders. That's not cool. At least it's done. Shit. Thank God it gives me something to, like, attack back with. Otherwise, I don't know what I'd do. Just aimlessly run around. <laughs> oh, thank you for the save station. Appreciate it. Trying to communicate with me, eh? Hmm. What is that? Ooh. Something tried to break through? Whoa. 
Whoa. That sounds great. That sounds fun. Okay. Aha. Finally, I have returned to Niflheim we eat. Honey, I'm home. Always a good sound. <clears throat> Dr. Lisa Svensson, day 89 of the N527 excavations. During the expansion of N527, several remains of the natives were uncovered. This was the first time any of us could get close to any of these violent and immense creatures. Analysis of the ice surrounding the remains proves that they have been here for well over 400,000 years. This means that they existed even before the woolly mammoth. What is even more fascinating is that they seem to have changed very little within the last hundreds of thousands of years. Like evolution is on a standstill in this world. <clears throat> we didn't expect this and we have to conduct research around these remains. I would like properly educated staff to be added to our ranks so we can uncover the history of these violent creatures. Dr. Lisa Svensson, N527. Hey, y'all got any, uh, collectibles around here? Like, having one right here would be, like, a smart move, but... Aw, oh, crap. Well, just walk around again. None of them things to those tablets, those rune things. Hmm. Thought for sure there might be a collectible in this room. Seems like the perfect room for it. Oh well. And nothing at the top of the finger, huh? I don't see anything. Alright, we're here. Fantastic. Right. Where are we going? Am I going up there? Into the elevator, the lift. Any collectibles? Any of them green things? No? Shit. Nothing, huh? Game is being rather rude to me. Ah, invisible barrier. Invisible barrier. I feel like now games are finally embracing Norse mythology, that it's a good medium to use for whatever type of game you're creating. Whether it be what God of War did, what Hellblade did with its like take on mental illness and everything like that. And now, with Absolov taking on a full-on horror approach, I'm glad to see that certain game developers are seeing, like, yes, this is a good vessel for, for storytelling. For years, it was, like, Roman mythology. And then there was a big chunk of time where it was nothing but Greek. So it's nice to see some different, like, uh, games, like, branching out and trying new things. I like that. I'm totally here for it. Uh, okay. Hmm. Hello. 
Nine. That's fantastic. That's nine, right? Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, nine. Yeah, das ist gut. These are the showers. Which there's nothing in here. Y'all sure you don't want to put anything in here once? Hmm, is that another one? Oh, I feel like this is a trap, though. Number 10. Hell yeah. I can have two charge shots. Dr. Brian Roberts, Niflheim Operation Supervisor. Progress report on Niflheim Outpost N527. Our latest addition to the N527 management in the form of Dr. Lisa Svensson has been very challenging. On arrival, she exhibited clear signs of depression which had a major impact on staff morale and became a safety concern. I found out that she was involved in some form of accident, but I can find no records of such an accident. I believe she is telling the truth. In the future, I, the supervisor of Niflheim operations, can't be kept in the dark about such matters. However, after the uncovering of the native remains, Dr. Svensson has resumed her work within management and is starting to become a major asset to N527. Please disregard all prior transfer requests of Dr. Lisa Svensson from the N527 outpost. That one took a few tries. Aha. Half of them. Cool. was a better use at outpost N527 and I've spent a week in this in this freaking ice box I miss my family it wasn't even my fault I told them the artifacts were dangerous that sounded great We'll find a thing, but exploration is key. I'm gonna check over here first. There is something up there. Uh huh. Oh. Two of them things, huh? Okay, so we were supposed to go across that. Yep. Hang on, let me go recharge quick. I don't want to use my uh, discs whenever I don't need to. It's been a while since I found something in a locker, though, that's for sure. So... I get the feeling that I will find something in a locker soon. At some point. Alright, here we go. What are you hiding in here? Oh. Nothing. Can't even go through. Why is this here? Oh, yes, I could look over all my people. Ho ho ho. Can't wait. Hmm. I see the vase. Cool. You can probably make that jump. What's over there, I have no idea. Cycle that airlock. Is 
save station. Let's go. All right. I see that moving. Oh. Hey, boyo. He's moving. It dark. Like, really dark. Well, there's that over here. Good to know. Well, I'm glad I'm good at finding these damn things. That's for sure. So going down, huh? I don't know if I want to yell timber while doing it. Oh, I don't like the sound of that, though. Anything over here? No. Most people, when they play horror games, they just go straight for the objective. Me, I'm just like, what do you got? What do you got for me? Hmm. I must say, the sound design in this game is actually fantastic. Wow! Cool, man. Cool. That was a good one. There's no other collectibles around here, though. This would be a good area for one. One of them floating things. I just stumbled upon that other one. By accident. Okay, where is he? Of course, you know, if I die, having to start all over from that freaking checkpoint that's that far away... Oh, that's going to be a pain to deal with. That was so long ago, it feels like now. Oh, I see you. Oh, look, it's so ugly. Ugh. I had no idea what I was walking across. Oh. I had no idea. I'm sorry. I am so sorry, dude. Do not eat me. I sincerely apologize that I was walking all over your business. You know, that's your arm. You know, I'm, I'm terribly, terribly sorry. But, you know, homeboy, 
who's looking like Ryuk from Death Note over here. He's just lurking. Oh, save station. Yes. Oh my god. Alright, man. You wanna play? Shit. He's got glowing eyes. Ugh. You wanna play, dude? Let's play. Okay. This will be interesting. I'm not there. Why is the music picking up? Shit. Oh, this music is so good, though. Just gonna move one at a time. Haha. -ha. Take that, you bastards. cool I will say that music was so damn cool that was such good music all right okay we're back But I have to tell you Just that... Just insert the artifact key into the tablet and hurry back here. There's something we want to show you. Okay, but... The giant... Weirdo wolf-looking thingy... I'm pretty sure it's Fenrir. 
just helped me. We had a huge revelation. It is not evil. Okay, are we heading back there now? Yeah. Oh, we can go to 3F. Oh, we can go to all of them, can't we? I might want to do that just to see what's there. Maybe some upgrades for this thing. Hey man, I'm back. I made it. Alright, let me save quick. Let me grab my uh, floaty ball. Fantastic. We're good to go. <gasps> oh my Jesus Christ. Something I want to show you. Something you need to see. Uh, does it want me to put it maybe on this thing? Is that a yes? Land some kind of like maze labyrinth thingy. Hey, dude, your room sucks. Hmm. Let's go in here. Sarah, you were right. Tell me, did you see him? Did you see the spirit from the machine? What the hell? What did you do? Don't you, you see? You killed me! You have direct access to the spirit's lair. None of us can reach it but you. You can go there anytime you want. Did you have the Jan Graper with you? Yes! You but... can even bring things with you? Oh, fantastic! I believe that the ether that you just came from is the home of the spirit from the machine. I believe that this spirit is Loki. Wait a minute, honey. You can't just assume that. We don't know. You are crazy. I've had enough of this. No, please listen to me. I am sorry Henrik did that to you. 
we knew perfectly fine that it wasn't going to kill you, and it wasn't like we could ask you to, to die for us. I'm not a test subject. You, you can't kill me for some damn experiment! I promise. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, please don't let the world end. Sarah, tell her what you told me before. Beneath the shadow of Yggdrasil, in the well of wisdom, is where the final artifact key can be recovered. In the depth, under the tree of all things. But that is not all it holds. On your way to the depth, you should be able to recover another artifact, the Eye of Odin. When you die, you have to find orbs before you can return, correct? I do. If you activate the Eye of Odin on those orbs, then you will touch them with divine magic. Then, placing them in the keyholes won't just let you pass back to Midgard. It will let you destroy the ether with a spirit left inside. We just need to find a route leading to the well. I know of one. <laughs> what? I'm, I'm sorry I didn't tell you, Sarah. Before I got in contact with you again, I found the well. When I did, I, th I thought I could fix all of this. And just like the All Father Odin, I sacrificed my eye for wisdom. Oh, Henrik. It didn't work. The root that leads to the well is underneath us, in the waste treatment plant. Scan my hand, and you'll gain access to it through the elevator. That should do it. Head down to the waste treatment plant. It should be a straight path from there. Good luck. And be careful down there. Never let the lights go out. In the worst case scenario, you always have the young ape in. Okay. Uh We got some keys. I'm going ahead and save after that little <laughs> bundle of joy that just killed me and did that for me. That was fantastic. I don't want to go all the way down just yet. I want to go explore some of those rooms that I can go to. Let's go to 2F. I want to see what's up there. See if I can get some more uh, of these things. The green things. Because I can have uh, five more. Aha. Uh -huh. Cool. Oh, wait, this is just floor two. Okay. Floor two. Absolob research. Let's go to three. There's still a few rooms on two that I need to go into. I haven't seen those yet. It is so damn dark up here, though. Ah. I'll open that door, too, huh? All right, I'm in. It's like a big sword. Aha. Another one. It opened this one too, right? Oh wow, you need key seven for that one. Huh? Well, at least that's done. I got another one. Hello. Nothing here. Oh. The machine. Something entered our world and it's speaking to us from the machines. 
The conversations among the crew are turning into fanatic gibberish. They're talking about higher beings from beyond the roots, about eternal life and ascension through the knowledge of the spirit in the machine. I fear what might come out of this. All right, so I can't go into one room up here. That's okay. Still got the top four. Let's take a look. There's still a few rooms on the second floor that I can check out. I want to make sure that I have plenty of stuff before I go down to that basement. That is a call. Oh. Everyone took it. The blood that came through the roots, they just drank it. With no regard to their own well being, or ethics, or reason. Consider this note my resignation. I'm heading to the surface right away before this madness spirals completely out of control. Did he make it? Probably not. Uh, nothing else up here, but I did get those four and the audio logs, so that feels worth it to me. Uh-huh, nothing. Mm -hmm. Nothing in there. Nope. Okay. All right, let's go back to floor two. There were a few things. There were a few things that I could do there. And I'll have to find them the save station. Been in these rooms. Go in here. Family researcher Yang, no twelve. I had heard much about Borg Corp before attending the first interviews. Uh, most of it mixed, as is usually the case of enterprises built around the ideas of single eccentric individuals but the way people spoke about it it sounded more like some idealistic crusade rather than a, a scientific excursion um, perhaps that's why i took the job to begin with to disprove the pseudoscience proposed by others working on the logical puzzle that is the absolov from the beginning i have treated this as a natural phenomena and i will not simply believe in time, we'll find an explanation for the Absolov's existence. And by then, I hope the fool-spouting paganistic nonsense will be a long way from here. Good luck with that one, dude. Just saying. Huh. I need a key code for this one, huh? Hmm. I wonder where that code could be. That's where I came from. There's that thing walking. Okay. Let's go down a floor. And see if there's any more doors to open down there. I've done everything I can on this floor for now. Okay. Wow, really? Nothing, eh? Hmm. Curious. That door is like fully locked. Oh, a safe station. Neato.
suppose that's good. I'll probably use this one again once I've uh, finished down here. Anything in here? No. Ah, five. Aha! Dr. Michael Brown, note. Dr. Anderson has tasked me with the assignment to research Helheim, the realm of the dead. The realm of the dead used to be under the control of the goddess Hell, but according to Dr. Anderson, Hell was murdered on her throne a long time ago. According to texts found in Svartalfheim, Helheim has been rotting away since the departure of its righteous ruler. A new creature has emerged called Keepers of Helheim that has been feeding on the souls of the dead for hundreds of years. <laughs> is this what happens when we die? We become food. Ooh. The only researcher, yeah, 2625. The Absolof containment facility has grown in equal proportions to the discoveries made during the last few months. The various spatial phenomena occurring in the vicinity of the Absolov are astounding, and the materials excavated are just... Uh, they're alien in nature and most likely dangerous. And I keep wondering about Dr. Henrik Anderson's intentions. It's clear he's looking for something. At first, I figured it to be a religious reasoning behind his actions. But when I came across a schedule for the facility, I noticed how Anderson has apparently moved his own daughter into one of the advanced care units. He's planning something. I want to find out what. You're holding something. <clears throat> Wow, that's how you get seven, huh? Interesting. Whoa. Okay. That's interesting. Sorry for doing that to you, dude. So I have seven. Okay. Um, wasn't the one on floor three for a seven? It might have been. I'm gonna go check it really quick. I'm sorry. I'm just really into the game. I'm really into it, and I wanna like get as much stuff as I can. Like we only have four more slots. We've got the seven key. I just want all the lore and all the stuff possible. They put all the stuff in the game for us to explore. Ooh. Even though it's only that, got 18 of them now. That's pretty good. I do like that. Okay. Thank you, game. All right. Four, three, Absolob research. Um. Open the door with the code. Four, two, Absolob research. I think we're done for now. I think so. I think so. I think so, yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and do this. And we'll head down to the lower level now. I've done everything I can. Research. 
So I'm only missing one Don't head left. Use the eye of Odin until the last Absolute key is inserted. Uh, good to know. 